makeup but like recreating Harley's makeup but I'm gonna put my own twist on it so yeah just for Halloween because I think this is the only Halloween one I'm gonna be doing I thought I was gonna do that rainbow monster I talked about in my last video but I'm just not gonna do it because I tried and I failed the last time I tried so I'm just not gonna do that one I'm just gonna do this one because as you see my hair is like red and blue so I said why not I can try it I've been debating about doing this one since forever so <laughs> I just like choked so let's just get into it I'm gonna be using my pro concealer by LA I'm just gonna be putting the, that all over my eyelids I hate that when I take my glasses off I'm sorry I'm just gonna move you guys closer I can't see basically <laughs> I'm just gonna be putting this on okay so I just wanted to chit chat with you guys and just talk because I know I don't talk in most of my videos and I did make a get ready with me I just never uploaded it and I talked throughout the whole thing I just don't think that I, I didn't like that video very much I didn't like the look that I did so I just didn't post it basically and that's like what happens to 99% of my videos like I could be pushing content out all the time but I don't like like 90% of my videos so that's why I don't have one up all the time but I'm like I'm trying but I'm telling you guys around Christmas I'm gonna have videos up all the time I'm gonna be doing vlogmas I'm gonna be doing all that even though my life's not that interesting to vlog i'm probably just gonna be house in household time but i'm probably gonna be going places to get decorations i'm going to be going to like christmasy places so i want to bring you guys along and record it basically because i don't know i'm gonna go all out for this christmas unless i'm gonna have money other than that i'm pretty sure i'm gonna go all out this christmas okay so i'm just gonna start my show now I'm gonna be using, I'm just using this from the, okay. I'm gonna be using Fire from the Morphe 3502 palette, which is just this color. I really want another Morphe palette. I just haven't figured out which one I want yet. I wish they had the colorful one still. I really want like a palette. It doesn't even have to be Morphe just like a makeup palette that has like so many different colors I know I have the take me to Brazil one uh, remade but this one I don't know these colors I feel like aren't that pigmented I don't know if it's just me that has problem with it I do like BH Cosmetics their eyeshadows are good I just don't think that they're very pigmented wait let me look at this photo so I don't do the wrong side because I'm pretty sure this side is blue and then this side is red. Yeah, I'm very okay. I would have messed up if I did this side red and this side blue. Anyways, okay, so I'm gonna go in and just blend and put it all over my eyelid. Well, not my whole eyelid because I'm gonna be doing more than this, just this color. But, anyways, um. I just want to know, I don't want to know anything actually, I don't know what I'm talking about. I just been, honestly, school lately, I don't know if it's just because I'm like a 11th grader or what, but oh my god, is school so hard. I'm homeschooled, if anyone of you didn't know. It is like, I don't, I don't understand why it's so hard, but you know, I'll live. I haven't went into any school activities yet. I'm trying. I'm not, I'm, it's not like I'm not actually trying to. I am. But they're just not working. 
I didn't I really didn't want to do this before like I was gonna do this like way 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 in the beginning of October so I was looking at my cat but I was just like what's the point because everyone has done this before and she's like very popular to be done but I'm just like what the heck why not <laughs> like I just wanted to put at least one Halloween inspired makeup tutorial on here oh my god I literally have a pimple that wasn't there like two days ago you know what I should talk about I've been watching like a lot of movies lately because I have a lot of time on my hands when I'm not working or doing school so I've been watching a whole bunch of movies lately and I'm just gonna be talking about those okay so the first one I'm gonna be talking about is The Shape of Water first of all anyone who doesn't find that movie weird is very disturbing I don't understand like that movie's weird like the whole aspect of it is weird she falls in love with the monster the monster's like godlike and it's just this whole plot I don't want to ruin a movie for anyone but I just find it weird like I <laughs> It's and it's really dragged out. I don't know if I'm the only one with this opinion, but it's like it's really dragged out for it to be like a two hour movie for it, the plot to like not deepen. I don't know, maybe that's just me. Uh, that was just my thoughts on that one. That's just it was weird. I don't, I wouldn't consider it a good or bad movie. I just think it was weird. Like, that's all I have to really say about that one. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. I seen Hotel Artemis. I think that's what it's called. I think it's Hotel Artemis. If not, I'll put it, the real name up here while I'm talking about it. But yeah, I like that movie. It was good. I just think maybe... I don't know I feel like some parts were good and some parts weren't good like um the beginning was just like okay what's happening and then it's a well, lot of the movie is like what's happening because I don't know um, maybe there's like another one to that one but I was just confused for some of the movie it was a good movie though um that one I would get like give like four stars out of five shape of water i would get like three stars out of five because i don't know it's just weird <laughs> that's all i have to say i'm going to go to the blue side because i'm going to be doing this whole thing with the red and the blue so i'm just gonna get them the initial colors out of the way i'm gonna take a bigger brush for this one because i don't want to use the same brush i use for the red one I cannot find good brushes, you guys. So if everyone has like good brush suggestions, please tell me. Because I don't I don't know any good ones she has. But I'm gonna go into the BH Cosmetic Take Me to the Brazil palette, because this is the only one I have. Um into this shade right here. Or maybe I might even yeah, I might even go into the NYX Wicked Dreams. I don't know how to pronounce this, but it's basically this palette right here. I hope it's um, in focus. And I'm just going to go with this color that looks way darker than it actually is. Yeah, I'm going to go into that shade, and then I'm going to dip into the BH Cosmetics. Okay, anyways. So the next movie I'm going to talk about is... Actually, I just watched this movie last night. It was from 2015. It's Stockholm, Pennsylvania. And I'm going to tell you the plot and everything because this has been came out. So if you haven't seen it, I'm sorry. I'm going to run it for you. So fair warning, I'm about to talk about this movie. Okay, so Stockholm, Pennsylvania is basically about a girl who got kidnapped when she was four years old. And she basically... Um, was kidnapped for 17 years and so the movie begins with her in a car like a police car driving to her house that she lived when she wasn't kidnapped and the when she gets to her house 
there's obviously all these cameras and stuff because it was like an ongoing investigation for 17 years so of course there's gonna be cameras um she was like pretty weird um not pretty weird she was just like quiet because she obviously just got put into like a new place that she knows of because when you're four you're not gonna remember a lot of things so basically her parents are like excited to see her and like hug her and everything and i'm just like it's just i thought it was like weird because i don't know let me know if you guys think differently if you were kidnapped for 17 years and you were four when you got kidnapped you wouldn't remember the people that you were with before like your actual parents so like she obviously said yes to the hug but like it wasn't like she wanted to hug her so basically she says they talk to her for a while ask her how she's doing and all of that and she's like um answering them and the first thing was that she didn't want them to call her leanne because that was her name that the parents gave her but um the guy who kidnapped her gave her the name leia so she wanted them to call her leia because she didn't like the name leanne and she wasn't familiar with the name leanne so they called her leia so they respect her versus and everything but like they weren't well the dad was okay with it the mother wasn't really okay with it so throughout the whole movie it just like she ends up going to take a bus and going to see her kidnapper and it's like she doesn't really want to be with her family because she doesn't know anything because her cat kidnappers kept her in the basement basically so she didn't know much like he she just knew what he told her which wasn't much she didn't know how to do like a toaster or anything because he didn't let her in the kitchen she was only allowed to be downstairs anyways um um anyways so she went to see him and was talking to him the mom went crazy basically and that night the mother dumped the father and told him to get out because he she said he didn't care about her and leia basically so she like turned crazy she locked her up in her room and all of this stuff she was basically acting like a kidnapper um not on purpose she just wanted her child to be safe but like leia didn't know what the heck was happening and she didn't know her like she didn't know her because she wasn't with her for 17 years and she was kind of trained to think a certain way and do certain things so basically um she ends up at the end of the movie escaping from out the window and like going to a park and leaving the mother like a long thing like a long letter on the wall of her bedroom saying all this stuff and then she basically at the end told her mother that she was about to kidnap a child if you may put two and two together because at the end of the movie she was like looking at a child at a park and no one was around the child and she said she wanted to make something hers forever like she said she wanted to make something mine and i just thought it was crazy i thought it was a good movie i just i just found like faults in it because i'm just like if you were gone for 17 years she she didn't know anything like she knew some stuff but like not a lot like i just thought like it was a lot at the same at one time like i feel like if i'm sorry if i'm saying light and like and basically a lot but it's not gonna change <laughs> anyways i feel like um if you're gone for 17 years and she was like a little girl when she went missing then they should have been like easing her in to them and the home and everything but they were just like jumping right into it and acting like they were a family again and acting like nothing ever happened you know i just thought like maybe that it would be better if they act didn't act like nothing didn't happen 
I don't know. It was just weird in that aspect. But other than that, it was a good movie. Um, let's see what else I have to talk about. Other movies. I'm trying to think of the other movies I'm watching. Oh, the thing I just put on my eye was uh, ColourPop's Creeper. I don't know if they still sell this, but it just basically looks like this. It's a little red. I don't wear it a lot. So I just put it on my eyelid to make it more red. I'm thinking I might change this color. I don't really like it. Maybe, I'm thinking maybe a dark blue would be look better. Okay. I'm going to do a dark blue and then I'll be right back. I'm back. I don't know why I just did this, but whatever. Um, <laughs> I'm back. I like this color way more than I like the other color. I don't think it matched with the Harley theme. But anyways, the other movie I watched. Honestly, this movie pissed me off. And I'm not going to tell you why because it is kind of like a newest movie. So I'm not going to tell you exactly why. You're just going to have to look at it. Like, I want you to look at it because it is a great movie. I just was pissed off at the ending. And the fact that it is not a second movie to it is annoying. But whatever. I'm just going to read the books. So The Darkest Minds. Oh my god. It was such a good movie. But the ending of that movie will piss you off. Like, it's not a regular ending. I'm just going to tell you that if you watch it. It's not a regular ending, and it's gonna make you mad. I'm gonna keep like the it going all the way down because her stuff goes all the way down. I'm loving this. Anyways, um, I think that's really all the movies I've seen lately. Uh, I seen Hotel Transylvania too. I've never seen that, so I need to see the third one, which I haven't seen. I probably will watch it tonight. Like so I have started Orange is the New Black. I started it like two years ago, but I don't remember it from two years ago, so I had to start all over again. It's it's a pretty good show. I mean, I don't have anything to complain about with it. Um, now I'm just gonna put glitter. I'm not sure if I should do, cause I do have red and blue glitter from NYX, but I don't know if I wanna do these glitters. Huh, I'm thinking of gold. Um, hmm. Actually, I'm thinking a silver-ish gold. Like a light, 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 light gold. I'm just putting it on my eyes. I'm just dragging it. And I don't want it to be too intense. I just want it to be intense enough. You know? And then honestly, I might take the glitter I said I'm not going to use because I, I don't feel like cleaning it up. And I might just put a little bit, a little tiny bit on with that just so it could be um blended but anyways i'm taking let me should tell you the i'm just stupid because i just can't figure these things out sometimes okay yeah okay i'm probably i'm taking pure and i'll show you okay this one right here the exposure okay right here i use it so much in my videos so you know why not use it now okay anyway um okay so my big idea to give this a little twist so i'm gonna take this i know it's not the same color as i want it to be but i'm not gonna be using it for anything bad i'm gonna, I'm gonna finish the eyes later i just want to do get this part over with to see if I like it or not, basically. So, I'm gonna take this. I'm gonna do. Um, excuse me? Why is this freaking. No, this is 
is amazing. Why is this so big <laughs> compared to this side? Like, what the heck? Okay. And now, on this side, I'm going to take this blue eyeliner. I'm going to tell you guys which ones they are. They are in a second. I just want to make sure. Okay. I'm digging into the red shade I took from my eye. I'm gonna see. Okay, so now. So basically, I'm gonna take the concealer and I'm gonna take a sponge. I'm just gonna fill in the spaces. I don't really have much of this left, so I don't know if this is gonna be. So I put it the concealer on. I'm gonna see if this makes it look any better. I'm really digging into this red, so I don't know. It's not the red's fault, obviously. Just and I don't care if it looks messy because Harley look was look wasn't like um clean and cut so I'm not here I'm just gonna clean the edges a little bit in this gel liner and Trying to take okay, let's see. I should have thought this through. <laughs> I'm just gonna open my eyes really wide and pull down with the pencil. I'm not gonna be talking while I'm doing my eyeliner because I can't do my eyeliner by talking, just so you guys know. And I have to be comfortable doing my eyeliner because eyeliner is hard. So, since I messed up on the thing just a little bit, I'm going to darken the under eye with um, this brush, probably. And I'm just going to use the Morphe Black shade. This one right here, I'm not going to tell you the number because it shouldn't matter. It's just the black. You're going to use any black. I'm sure it'll work either way. Okay. I'm just going to take this. And I'm literally just going under and darkening it. I think I'm liking it so far. Okay, anyways. Let's do mascara. I don't have lashes because I don't wear lashes. So I'm not going to do that. So we're just going to do regular mascara. Mixing them. Like I always do. Okay. Okay. 
I use the NYX Professional Makeup in Ink Liner in black. And then I use the other NYX Gel Glide Liner in black also. I use the LA Girl Perfect Precision Eyeliner in blue. And then I use the NYX Vivid Bright Vivid Fire basically just red and I used this up. look I don't do much for my eyebrows so yeah I'm sorry if I'm not talking a lot in this video I'm, I'm meaning to it's just not working um, let's see, let's see what to talk about. Um, what are you guys planning on doing for Halloween? Have you guys went to the Halloween parties? I haven't went to any Halloween parties, but I am going to give candy out to little kids that I'm going to be buying probably soon. And... Uh, Yeah, my house is all decorated and stuff. This is the first year it's ever been decorated, so it's pretty exciting, guys. I'm wondering if I should fill my eyebrows in. Let's see how Harley had her eyebrows. I don't do my eyebrows like that, so if it looks horrible, I'm sorry. But it's the best I can do. Darking them up a little bit. I'm just going where the eye brow hairs already are, and I'm done with that. And then I'm just gonna go back in and stop. So what do you guys, who are you guys' favorite um, YouTubers so far? Well, not so far, but like favorite YouTubers. I don't know why I said so far. I'm sorry about the tapping. Just trying to get it off of the brush. Okay. Mine, I don't know their names by heart. I don't follow a lot of beauty YouTubers because I just don't. Very drama filled, and I don't feel like it. <laughs> but I follow, like, I like following the people who do the cleaning my room at 2 a.m. Um, there's another girl I like, and she's just funny. And they, I watch gamers too. Laser Beam, I watch. That's probably a surprise to a lot of people, but you know, I like that game fortnite he does fortnite videos so yeah um i'm on youtube like all the time most of the time basically i forgot to mention the badge but whatever <laughs> not the backdrop the background i changed it i hope you guys like it I like it. I just did it today, actually. Um, we're doing the signature lipstick now. I would do a half and half, but I don't have blue lipstick. Uh, what do you guys 
guys think of music? I've been need, I've been wanting more music to look listen to. So if you guys wanna recommend me some, I wouldn't be opposed. Okay, I need to just see which side her smear is. You see a lot of Billy Elise. I'm sorry if I'm saying it wrong. Billy Elise, Billy Ellis. I'm sorry. I love her. <laughs> and Summer Walker. Walker. And LMA. I just been listening to her. And that one song from um, let me see. I think it's NBA Young Boy is good i've been listening to a lot of songs on vp lately does anyone else do that i feel like i listen to songs over and 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 over again until i'm sick of it and then i'll delete it does anyone else do that i'm just a little bit redder color volcano from nyx It's really not that effective. <laughs> eh. It is what it is. Uh, I'm sorry, guys. I really don't know what to talk about. Oh, I should just look up questions. Like, that's not something I thought about at all. <laughs> okay. First question is, are you in love? No, I am not. Um, I don't, I'm not going to elaborate on that question. Uh, this pimple is really getting on my nerves. Second question, do you like coffee? Yes, I like coffee. I just don't drink it as much. I want like a coffee maker because I would drink it much, a lot, much. I'm stupid. <laughs> I would drink it a lot if I had a coffee maker. Like specifically if I had a part coffee maker. Um... I'm gonna do the heart right here. The heart is right here in one of the pictures, but other other pictures are over here. So I'm gonna do her heart. The third question is your dream vacation. Um, I really don't know what my dream vacation is. I'm gonna be quiet when I'm doing this heart because I'm probably gonna mess it up. Okay, now the pudding part. I really don't wanna do this one. <laughs> But I have to, so... Hmm. Not bad, not bad, not bad. <laughs> what is the finishing touches that I'm going to do? Oh, yeah, that's what that was lacking. This is like so con contrastable. Oh. This is not so good. I'm going to put red on this side. Just have the highlight in the middle and then put blue. I swear I'm sick of losing these freaking brushes and put blue on either like a contour. Hmm. I'm, ooh, I love this. Ooh, I gotta like put it together. Yes. Should I just put it all the way up? Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Are you guys getting excited against me or I'm just being annoying? Oh well, I'm excited. You're not excited, you don't gotta be. I'm just gonna put it like down to the 
eyes. I'll do the same thing for the red. May, how do we feel? My red brush. I like it a lot. Anyways, um... Oh my god, why am I loving this so much? Oh my lord Jesus, have mercy. <laughs> you guys don't know how much I'm like dying. I love Harley and I love the whole character Harley. Anyway, what was that? I should kill everyone and escape? <laughs> Sorry, the voices. I'm kidding. <laughs> That's not what they're doing. I'm too much. Okay, you guys. I am signing out from this one. I hope you guys enjoyed this Holly Quinn inspired just hair, makeup, everything that we went through together. Today. Make sure to leave a like, comment, and please subscribe. I'm sorry I had to like laugh because that was so cringy. <laughs> okay, bye guys. <laughs>